गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू बी बी एस एम एकेडमी ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ कोपनली एम्प्लॉज एसोसिएशन दिस इज ए स्पेशल क्लास फॉर रूरल स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ कर्नाटका दिस इज बी बी एस एम एकेडमी स्कूल ऑफ आर्ट्स एंड साइंस वर्किंग with a mission with a vision so my dear friends after the second day of corona i would like to give my biology class today what is biology biology is the study of living organisms divided into many specialized fields that cover their morphology physiology anatomy behavior origin and distribution the plants and animals of a particular area the physiology behavior and other qualities of a particular organism or class of organisms what is biology and all we should know parts of the plant parts of the leaf types of function of the roots uh, shoot system leaf system uh, root system and all now you know botany the main branches of biology is botany and zoology botany also called plant lines plant biology or phytology is the science of plant life and a branch biology a botanist plant scientist or phytologist is a scientist who specializes in the field of botany zoology is the branch of biology that studies the animal kingdom including the structure embryology evolution classification habits and distribution of all animals both living and extinct and how they interact with the ecosystems well friends now i would like to divert your attention towards the cell biology a branch of biology that studies the different structures and functions of the cell and focuses mainly on the idea of the cell as the fundamental basic unit of life cell biology explains the structure organization and physiological properties etc here Robert Hooke is the founder of microscope and the founder of the cell this is Robert Hooke and its and his uh, discovery that is microscope after the discovery of microscope only so many things have come up light in the science and technology today now this is done both on a microscopic and molecular level as it encompasses prokaryotic cells and eukaryotic cells you know and an uh, that is ancient van leeuwenhoek father of microbiology is responsible for studying the um, cytology or the mi microbiology for your kind information my dear friends what is a prokaryotic cell is a type of cell that does not have a true nucleus or membrane bound organelles organisms within the domains bacteria and archaea are based on the prokaryotic cell while all other forms life are eukaryotic cells bacterial cell anatomy in the prokaryotic cells they may also have pili small hair like structures that help bacteria adhere to surfaces and can allow dna that is deoxyribonucleic acid the capsule like structure with a sticky layer of carbohydrate that helps the bacterium adhere to the surface in its surroundings this is a bacterial cell anatomy my dear friends coming to the bacterial cell anatomy that is uh, how do prokaryotic cells divide division cell division prokaryotic cells divide through the process of binary fission binary fission what is fission do you know the meaning of fission my dear friends fission is nothing but breaking into two binary means breaking into two any material here the cell is breaking are divided into two daughter cells prokaryotic cells have only a small amount of dna deoxyribonucleic acid which is not stored in a complex chromosomes further there are no organelles so there is nothing to divide therefore when a prokaryote grows to a large size the process of binary fission takes place this process duplicates the dna then separates each new strand of dna into individual cells 
This process is similar, simpler than mitosis. This means that bacteria can reproduce much faster than most of eukaryotic organisms. Direct, divert your attention towards how small the uh, organelles, prokaryotic cell, which is uh, very, very small in size. Here, I have given, I am showing you HIV, 100 nanometers, very small size, invisible. It is only visible to uh, microscope. For example, you know, here, next E. coli, 2 micrometer. 2 micrometer means very small size, uh, invisible particle. For example, uh, it is uh, next you can RBC red blood cells that is 68 micrometer and the lymphocyte uh, that is 69 micrometer this virus similarly the so called coronavirus now coming to the uh, the size of the prokaryotic cell with poly versus the cells and the, the virus these are the sizes you know it is a 100 nanometer equal is a 2 micrometer eukaryotic cells and uh, a virus and the red blood cell all these things are very small in size when compared to this one this is the division this is depends upon the nature of the organelles all prokaryotic cells have a nucleoid region dna and rna as the genetic material ribosomes that make proteins and the cytosol that contains the cytoskeleton and that organizes cellular materials. However, prokaryotic organisms are very diverse group of organisms. Prokaryotic cells are usually between 0 0.1 to 5 micrometers in uh, uh, length. That is 0 0.0000012, 0.005 centimeters. Eukaryotic cells are generally much larger between 10 to 100 micrometers. Prokaryotic cells have a higher surface area to volume ratio because of their smaller which makes them able to obtain a larger amount of nutrients via their plasma membrane. These are the bacteria shapes, rods that is bacilli, spheres are cocci and the spiral. These are the different types and different shapes of the bacteria. Now this is the size of the prokaryotic cell, this is the uh, animal waste, this is the human waste uh, which contains uh, the prokaryotic cells that is E. coli bacteria. Eukaryotic and prokaryotic cells distinguish between those two, the membrane and closed nucleus nucleus and the mitochondrion, both are having ribosomes and uh, nucleolide is there, cell membrane. That is the main difference between the eukaryotic cell and prokaryotic cell. The difference is the cytoplasm and uh, here nucleus and ribosomes, DNA, cell wall. This is uh, the eukaryotic cell and prokaryotic cells. Thanks for watching. This is VVSM Academy. Classes of biology are started. And from here afterwards, please, if you like our videos, please like, share and subscribe. Don't forget to press bell icon. Thanks for watching. See you again in the next class. Take care of Corona. The second wave. Use mask. Keep social distance. And be safe. Ready for the forthcoming examinations. Good luck. Thank you. Thanks for watching.